So I heard you want to beat the Lost Sector fast. What's good guys, it's Zen, and I'm here with your daily Lost Sector guide. Now I have over 4,000 hours in this game, so if you listen to these tips, we will get those runs going as fast as possible for you and get those exotics. Now this video is a shorter version of the one I posted last week. I'm new to this YouTube thing and I wanted to test if short videos do better. If you want to watch the full version with the build that I used and the location of the Lost Sector, click the link below. Also, before you farm, you may want to check out these two videos. I had a lot of people asking me how to get triple 100s and what power level they should be farming at. If you need that info, there you go. Watch those and then come back to this one. Now this guide will be universal, meaning that any class can use it. With that out of the way, let's hop right into the video. First thing you're going to want to do when you enter here is proc your devour by throwing a grenade at this group of ads. When you get that devour, you'll be able to easily rampage through these ads. Now typically what I would say to do is double melee and finish them so that you get invis, but there aren't many ads in here and also these guys are super squishy. One glaive is not quite enough to finish and two of them actually just kills them, so that's no problem at all. We'll stun that guy just to take care of the rest of the ads and then we'll go back to him. And for the unstoppable, all you do is hold up your shield when he starts attacking and just melee him down, he dies very easily especially since this has overcharged glaives. Boom, take care of him, and then we'll just run through this hallway. You're gonna throw your grenade at them and take care of these guys, and then we'll proceed to the next room. Now this next room is the most difficult part of the Lost Sector. When you first come in here, you're going to shoot at the nearest Cabal, just to start the process. And again, we're just gonna double glaive everything and finish them. Now you see this gives us invis, it procs our devour, and we have an overshield really solidifying that whole process. And yeah, that's about it. We'll just finish all of these ads until there's gonna be these like white glowing cabal. We'll kill them and then that's gonna give us some orbs to proceed to the next room. But yeah, pretty much this room, we're just gonna be doing some ad clear. Now one thing to note, when you shoot your glaive, that actually gets them low enough to finish. Now you see these glowing guys have spawned those are the guys that I was talking about. We'll kill them, we'll grab their orbs, and then we will put them in the little dispensary thing, and then we'll be able to proceed to the next room. But again, what we're gonna do right now is just finish cl clearing out this room. Just be careful when you're dealing with these scions. Obviously, you can't finish the scions, so if you're gonna kill a scion, make sure there's a cabal near you to reproc your invis, otherwise you're gonna be in trouble. Now, these gladiators do quite a bit of damage, and they have quite a bit of health, so you're gonna wanna shoot them down. Unlike the other Cabal, you can't really just melee them down the whole time. You'll shoot them a couple times and then you can go for the finisher. And then once the room is clear, you can just start linearing these white glowing Cabal down. This guy's a little shy. We might actually just reposition so that we can get a better angle on him. No problem at all. A few more ads spawn, which is no problem at all. We're just going to deal with them and then we'll go back to the barrier. Alright, now we got the barrier in a sticky situation. This guy's screwed. Just take care of him. Boom, now we got two orbs. Now we just clear out these ads and then we can proceed to the boss room. And the boss room is super easy, guys. Actually, this lost sector is so easy. It's just this room that can give you a bit of trouble. Sometimes you get stuck with no invis, but truly it's no problem at all. As long as you follow the tips, you'll get a really good farm out of this. Alright, so we have one more room here before the boss room, actually. It's just going to be rinse and repeat of the first room. You're going to take care of the ads, try to proc your devour, although you really don't need it. Um, and then there's just one unstoppable. Take care of him, and then we can proceed to the boss room. Super simple stuff, but you're going to want to kill all the ads first. Okay, now that we're here, you're going to want to run in just a little bit, just into the point where that Cabal dropship drops on the boss and then the real boss will spawn, and you're just gonna linear this guy down. Eventually, he will get low enough and he'll start to hide, but that's when you just run up, pop your super, and then that's the whole lost sector. Super easy, guys. If you stand in just the right place, it's a bit of a head glitch. He can't hit you, but you can hit him. It is a fantastic angle right here. Really just trivializes this lost sector. Yep, just do as much damage to him as you can, and then you just push in with your super. Now, obviously, this is super risky. You're probably gonna die doing this, but it doesn't matter too much as you will kill the boss in the process. And then that's it. You just run up, grab the chest, and that's it. Seven minute farm, but it's super fast, and I'm betting that you can get it down to six minutes if you just continue to run it. Now, before you destroy your mouse, clicking off the video to go farm with your new strats, I'd like to re-grab your attention for 10 seconds. First of all, 
Don't forget to check out how to get triple 100s and what level you should be farming Lost Sectors at. If you don't know these two things, your runs will be much slower than needed. Also, here's my issue, bro. Only 2% of my viewers are subscribed. This is so sad. You've never seen a YouTuber with a ratio like this. <laughs> like, what are we doing here, bro? Now, here's a trade offer. I give a good guide. If you find any value in this, you give a good sub. I post daily Lost Sector guides at a minimum, but I also work in some entertaining stuff. There's new Destiny 2 videos daily, and I also post Pokemon if you're into that game. Either way, thanks for watching, good luck farming, and I'll see you tomorrow for the next Lost Sector.